Hello everyone, Epic PC Master here, and this is my first video that I will be posting on YouTube. And my videos I will probably mostly be doing um, how to's of modding games and stuff like that. Like this here is a tool used to make, use a P PlayStation 3 controller on your PC and I will be showing you how to use that today um, okay so here we go uh, first what you want to do is you're gonna need a, the USB the charger piece that plugs into your PS3 and your controller um, you're gonna plug plug that into your computer and then into um, your control your controller and then um, you're going to go to motionenjoy.com um, well this is just the name of it but just go to their on the website uh, go to their website and download if your computer or which file is correct um, like if your computer is a 32 bit or a 64 bit doesn't matter or whatever uh, oh, I'm sorry um, okay so once that's in you're going to download it and then uh, you're gonna need WinRAR first, though, you to download it. WinRAR or 7-Zip, something like that, a downloader program, downloading program. Um, then once your application is downloaded, it's gonna come up as DS3 tool on your desktop, and you're gonna click that, and this page is gonna come up. And uh, first, my uh, my controller is already recognized. This is what it says. So for your usually it will say um, searching for devices before you plug in you have to make sure your controller is plugged in before you start so open this up and then plug in your controller and then go to the driver manager oh uh oh what happened load okay so you're gonna go to driver manager if this thing will load up oh. Here we go. Come on. And okay, so yes, it will see waiting for controllers to be set up. Mine's there. So then you're gonna go to driver manager. And first what you're gonna do, Joe, this is the make sure there's no other USBs plugged in when you start this. Um so this is your PS3 controller that is plugged into your um, computer. And you're gonna check that and you're going to push load driver let it load my computer's a little slow so it's just going to take a few seconds uh, it's not responding anyways you're going to push load and it will say down here in text uh, it will have like a bunch of um, text down here that will pop up and then it will, oh like this it will say completed and then you're going to go to install all I've already done this so it will say it should say do all this and it should say completed mines I've already done this so it will just say it's already been installed so we can skip I can skip that but you're gonna have to wait make sure so it says was successful mines is already installed in but you're gonna ha wait till it says completed and then your PS3 controller should be in then what you're gonna do after that is close the program and restart reboot your computer and when okay yeah so reboot your computer then open up the program again make sure before you open up the program that your com controller is plugged into your computer and go to profile and these are the different um, types of uh, controller you would use like if uh, um, this one right here they're actually these these two aren't very I wouldn't check these it, it would I wouldn't this is the type of um, controller the the way the buttons that format it would be using and the best ones would be this one the PlayStation 2 pov joysticks analog tr trigger or the PlayStation 3 or the custom which is you design it yourself I designed it for um, just a regular gamepad and dead space too um, yeah so you choose one of these and I have my 
PlayStation 3 one. I'm going to be doing it using it for Halo. And yeah, so I'll show you there and then I'll show you with the um how how it works or when you're playing. So wait, so first you're going to have to check check one of these and push enable. That enables it. Nothing's going to pop up. You just have to just click enable and go to your game. Okay, so here's the game. So I'm going to use the controller. Whoops, glitching. So I'm using the controller right now. And I'll do a live um, video thingy of how me controlling it with it. Okay, so I'm just gonna work, do this real quick. Just show you how it works. So. There we are. Jump. Sometimes you're gonna have to actually um when you're if you're gonna use it for Halo. Actually no, there's really no point in telling you this. Never mind. Okay, so that's how it works and now I'm going to show you how it works in the re regular I mean I'm sorry, this is very, my very first video. Um I'm going to show you it where me controlling you see my hands controlling so you don't think I'm just tricking you. This really does work, but there is a lot of work to it, figuring out, like, customizing control controls and stuff. So, yeah. Okay, so here it is. The PS3 controller. Yes, I have a pink controller. Um, so first... Hold on. So I'm going to go to Halo. So as you can see, controlling it like that, it's kind of hard to control it. Oh, whoops. Hold on. I'm going to try to use both hands. Um, so like move back, side. So as you can see, it works. So yeah. So that is... How you do it? Peace out.